The Port of Long Beach is committed to being the greenest port in the country by going all zero emissions by 2035. Many new technologies will be required to meet this clean air objective, and having a commercially viable green hydrogen fuel option is key. To make sure zero emissions vehicles can get the hydrogen fuel they will need, the Port of Long Beach and the City of Long Beach have joined the Alliance for Renewable Clean Hydrogen Energy Systems, or ARCHES, a public-private partnership formed to help capture newly available federal funding to assist in developing a robust market in California for renewable hydrogen. Well, the governor set a very high bar for California to transition to a carbon-free economy, and that's going to require all of the above in terms of new sources of energy and new ways of distributing that energy, and hydrogen is going to be a very, very important element for those hard-to-electrify sectors of our economy, like mobility, big truck, big heavy trucks, and heavy industry, and the ports that we see right here. So hydrogen, again, is going to be a key component of that transition to a carbon-free economy, and this creating a hydrogen hub here in all of California to bring together the generation of clean hydrogen and the use of it across our different sectors uh, is very key. We want to get the federal support. They're supporting a number of projects around the country. We're competing for that support. We could get up to $1.25 billion, which will drive billions more in private investment to accelerate that transition and to make green hydrogen, renewable green hydrogen, totally um, pollution free, uh, a staple of all those sectors in, in our state. And we're really excited about the opportunity. The governor's really excited about the opportunity. The Alliance is all about promoting, and it's not just about promoting anymore, moving forward the hydrogen fuel agenda, which is moving very fast now. So it's a great milestone now, as you've seen uh, the trucks in the background, they're here. Uh, it's gonna be a few more years before we really get them uh, commercially accessible, but the great, the great news here is that we're seeing that the hydrogen fuel truck has arrived. At the press conference announcing this new alliance, several hydrogen vehicles were on display, showcasing the potential of clean hydrogen as a fuel for heavy-duty vehicles like port trucks. What's really exciting about this is that hydrogen technology is no longer theory, it's real. We can uh, invest in the infrastructure to fuel our buses and transit systems, uh, to fuel goods movement and heavy-duty vehicles that are moving freight from our ports out into the Inland Empire. And it has to start here. There are 6,000 trucks that are currently on diesel that we need to look at alternative fuels in order to clean it up so that frontline communities right here in Long Beach and across Southern California receive the environmental benefits, but also the economic benefits of investing in infrastructure. This is a really awesome um, day in that what we have done is we have uh, signed on to support Arches. So not only as a city, but we also uh, as the port of Long Beach which is going to be really instrumental in the success of Arches. Green hydrogen is an important fuel for the future of the shipping industry, and the Port of Long Beach, as an Arches partner, will play a vital role in accelerating the transition to clean energy for the entire country. To learn more about the port's quest to reach zero emissions, visit www.polb.com forward slash zero emissions.